The name of the collection is Bijoux de Tête. So the collection was inspired by the street wardrobe. There is four main typology of hats. There is the beanie, there is the durag, and the headband, and finally the bucket hat. Every pieces are made uh, with different kind of uh, hair donations, with uh, seven different stories of uh, seven individuals. One of our main pieces is a story between a couple who the girl is going to cut her hair and decided to give us our hair to make a special pieces for his boyfriend. Mm -hmm. So it's a, a duag which is with a blown peroxide hair that had weaved and then stitched with leather to create the structure of the pieces. Each uh, pieces of our collection have a brass buckle with a name engraved on it. So it's the name of the people who gave their hair and the people who received the pieces. So basically we have four main techniques. Weaving, knitting, felting, and textile screen printing of hair powder as a pigment. This whole the technique and craft machine that we took inspiration from disappeared in the late 20th century. And it was a tradition to take the hair of somebody who passed away or somebody who was born to make jewelry of sentimental pieces. Basically, we went to the archives in France, into UK, to take inspiration from old jewelry. The piece we made for Hermes was uh, the continuation of our collection, I guess. A piece that contained uh, hair horses that was weaved by Antonin. So the idea is to have a jewelry that the horse owner can have and have a pieces of the hair sore. And it's a uh, jewelry that can be worn in different type of situation, as a harness or uh, a necklace, and also can be attached on the horse harness.